how are we doing everyone um we're back and today we're back with something real uh we're going I took a sip of water we're gonna be playing a really hard skyrim mod this is kind of a classic uh in the in the in the modding community you guys, you guys need to be quiet i got these two guys i stole them we're, le we're leaving my sons here um going out into the new world this is a character I, I like this is like a character i play with on my free time um this is darkened this is a skyrim mod um it's a very it's like one of the hardest ones it's heavily based off of like uh demons and dark souls so i'm excited because it's actually been a while since i've like I, I don't think i've actually sat down and played a quest mod since i was like i don't even know like dude it's been so long probably probably since i was still like in my single digits if i'm being honest with you no okay that's not true probably like before like in my middle school maybe even before middle school years you know so heavily inspired by dark souls really hard mod i'm pretty sure it's like not even really a quest it's more just an area you can explore um so i think this is where it is the voyager's end so yeah it's inspired by dark souls not in the sense that it's just like you know hard difficult i mean it is but it's um it's made with the level design in mind so you know there's no there's no quest markers um the environments are very like pretty and nice and very well designed there's a dog um so yeah i'm excited um i'm a bit of a souls fiend this is actually a character i have that's like modded to like kind of simulate souls combat in skyrim i know that's kind of frowned upon because it's like just something like you know instead of trying to turn your game into something else you should just try to play to its strengths uh fuck you so yeah i'm excited i don't know i don't know what this entails i am also i should mention that i'm actually not like playing like the like the default version of this mod i'm playing the mod with a difficulty rebalance and or just a rebalance in general i think it makes some items that you get less powerful make some enemies less overpowered stuff like that um and um i'm also playing with some patches that are mostly like just technical stuff so it's not like anything game changing i am playing with a lot of combat mods too I i'll go through those in a second just so that way we're all on the same page that this is not vanilla all right so i will do the uh the very cool thing and read through all of these Third of Rain's Hand, 4E198. Then they all died. So what, they just stole like a piece of rock? Or is this thing the artifact? Well, ancient shrine discovered. So here we are, I'm very excited for this. I don't have a guide on me or anything, so hopefully we don't get stuck anywhere. I don't know if this is like this has like puzzles and stuff. If it does, we're gonna be here for about six years, but uh, so I'm assuming that's how you get back. Or no, can you just go back through this? Well then what was everyone complaining about? Just go back. Too many This is so eerie though. Like I, I feel like I'm gonna get jumped by something. This is good. There's gonna be there's gonna be something in here. Oh my, on my mama. Wow. Lock picking god. The bright side I hear had the heavy breathing, so I'm a little bit less scared. I take it back. I'm, 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 I'm scared. I'm taking out an earbud. I'm taking out an earbud. They're gonna jump scare me. I can hear heavy breathing, but there's no. Cause if there was any hostile NPC in here, they would have alerted. They would have been alerted. Just let me take your damn sword. I'm not even gonna use it. I just want to put it in my pocket. I should have brought one of the bugs with me. Okay, that's. Thank you. I can't tell if those textures are broken or if they're supposed to look like that. I'm gonna assume they're supposed to look like that, so I don't have to like go through and bug fix this, and I'm really scared I don't want to be in this fucking house anymore. Oh, okay, cool. I'm gonna die instantly. I just yeah, I did just break into a grave, so that's kind of on me. Someone's in here. Whoa, that's so cool. I wonder if that does that do anything? Priest that's a big ass journal. Wait, wait, holy fuck. God damn, bro, he was writing a lot. That's the size that's like bigger than my hand. I guess most books are, but is there a way I can get up? Because I definitely hear someone. 
Yeah, I can hear the heavy breathing. It's not the same as the one in the house, which is like kind of even more unsettling, if I'm being honest. Hi! Oh, look at you, little squid face. How you doing? Ritualist? Okay, you're pretty tough. Okay, that was a... Try again. Okay, ow, 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 what the fuck? Good thing I'm like 50% resistant to fire. Dark elf, bitch. Oh, oh, that, oh, okay, there's two of you. I was like, because she punched me. I thought she just exploded. I, I don't know why I'm saying it's a she. I'm sorry. I don't know. The squid monster thing. I don't know if it has a gender. Well, you two have a good day, even though you're dead. I, you know, honestly, in your condition, I feel like that might have been a, a saving grace for you. So far, the only gist I've gotten is there's some type of, like, infection going around. And that's what's, like, that's what, like, killed everyone. The thing is, the fact that everyone's a skeleton and, like, not, like, a corpse kind of makes me think this is, like, happened a long time ago. This house looks absolutely dreadful. Thank God. I'm kind of, I'm kind of glad I can't go in there because I don't even want to know what the fuck is in here. Oh, I can. Perfect. Ghost, if you jump me, I will hit you. Alright, we're good. I think that scared him off. Like, I don't want, like, the two arrows in this guy's inventory. Oh, get fucked. Whoa! Oh, I thought that was a fucking skeleton horse. I was, that would've been so cool. Yeah, I don't want his 13 arrows. Wait, how much is this even worth? 50 gold. Broke-ass bow. But does the retcon shit all the time. Oh, fuck no. Oh, fuck no. Oh, fuck no. Hi, are you friendly? Dragon God? I think I hear that breathing again. So, oh, okay, thank God. See, when I know where the breathing's coming from, it's not as bad. Because I, I walked in there, I instantly just got PTSD from that old house, but... Hi, who are you? You're a very shiny statue. Is that your arrow? Oh, you f okay, that was not your arrow. But yeah, I think if... if fucking lock cannot be picked. You need a key, asshole. Wish I, I wish I brought like someone along with me. I don't even know if followers can. Oh my god. Um. Okay. Okay. Wow. Yeah. You guys are real mature. Just fucking gang up on me like that. Okay. Cool. So okay. One thing I also like about this mod, I kind of like and I kind of dislike. I like that there are just like kind of areas that are just here to like build the world. Like there's nothing important here. I'm pretty sure, right? But there's just stuff like this that just like helps build the world like you know someone lived here and like used this room it's really nice it's really good world building um i like it because you know it adds to the setting how about you come down here and you hit me with your sword like a man or maybe you were a woman i guess you're just a skeleton but like you know i mean regardless you know what i mean like just come and hit me instead of shooting me jackass please don't be locked oh thank you oh <laughs> Oh my fucking god! Oh my fucking god! Oh my fucking god! That was crazy. I don't know if that was intentional. I that that is insane. I can't believe that just happened to me. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. You're kind of not that tough, but that scared the fuck out of me, bro. Holy shit! And I guarantee there's nothing up here that we even need. Who's fucking? Can someone put a goddamn leash on their dog? All right, I'm gonna fucking. What's up? Oh, you hit me, really? I was gonna adopt you, but you're kind of a prick. Okay, and you broke my legs. Ow, ow, yeah, all right. Are you done, are you done? Hey, are you done, are you done? Okay, you done? There we go. There, your dog. Yeah, okay, well I didn't mean to kill him, he was just biting me. Get fucked. <laughs> Never gets old. Oh my god, what the hell is that thing? Hi there. This is my bow. Oh, okay, you're just a normal. Oh, you're the you're the big baddie. Okay. I'll fight you. Oh, fell. Okay. I'm going to do this because uh, I feel unsafe. Oh, okay, cool. What? You brought your f Oh, oh my god. Don't hey, hey, hey. Whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, wait. Let's not do that spell anymore. And I die. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. That was, uh, that was, um, that's gotta be record time for fucking around and finding out. Whoever made the, the mobile Twitch app is like literally the worst person on earth. That's a good paycheck. All right, let's see. 
Hey, what's up? God, don't- that spell is crazy, though. Oh yeah, I don't have any shouts either because, uh, I don't- I have, like, I just haven't touched the main story on this character, so... Oh, did I block that shit? Okay. Okay, that's nothing. I have a ward, what am I doing? Okay, breaks the ward instantly and still drains my health. Very cool. Got it. Okay, didn't get that. Stop! Stop! Stop, 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 stop. I'm just gonna hide here. One second. Something, something just fell over in my, in my home. Good news, no one's dead. It was just, it was a, it was a false alarm. False alarm, we're all good. No one's, no one's dead as far as I know, unless something happened in the, like, 20 seconds I was walking to my room. Alright, uh, let's see. Stop! 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 Okay? Stop? Yeah, okay, you're really just gonna- you're a prick and I hate you. Hey, check this out, huh? Oh yeah, you didn't like that, did you? Ooh! Oh, get fucked! Give me your- give me your shit, you better have like... Okay, Commander's Quarters and a Silver Elite Sword. I know I'm taking all these weapons and I'm never gonna use them, but like... Why do I have an Azura's Moon on me? Do you want this? You can have this. We can trade. Okay, we gotta use the context clues to fit together a story. This is a baby with the body of a naked woman. And that's all I- that's all I was able to take away from that. Oh my god, a shortcut? Nutty. So we got a key to the captain's quarters, but I don't know where the captain's quarters are. I think about how much shit would have smelled back then, like back now. Like in Skyrim, how much everything would just smell, because like nobody was taking showers. Nobody, they didn't know what showers were. I can't even, like, really blame them. Because they didn't know, the, like, the type of filth they were living in, but... At the same time, it's like... Yeah, see, that breathing. Okay, where, okay, what is this fucking key open, then? Why did I kill, why did I kill, like, God to get this key? Please, Lord, I beg of thee. No shampoo. I mean, shampoo is, like, what? Just for your hair? That's not even, like, that's not even the worst of it, like... They could not wash their asses. Like, they couldn't even wipe their ass if they shit, right? Like... Had to dig in there with their fingers. It's horrible. And then you get into a fist fight with them at the bar. Like, now you got knocked out, and you and you smell, and you got their shit on you. So like, why is it even? Why do we even bother? Remember when Romans used some stick to wipe their asses? I mean, the Romans like here's the thing, right? Like, kind of based for that. <laughs> at least they tried. You know what I mean? That's crazy. How do you know that? Like, I'm not even like judging. I'm just curious. How'd you figure? Like, how'd you find that out? Oh, okay, is this a diary? Night Commander's Journal. Okay, we're gonna read that once we steal some shit. Okay, I don't have a key for that. Yo, bro, I was playing chess? How the fuck? What? How did they- how did the mod out there make this? That's crazy. God damn, bro, this guy must be getting mad pussy. Holy shit. Crown. Ring of Steel Protection, Dark Souls reference. Give me that shit. That's cool. That is like just straight a Dark Souls ring. That is really cool. Alright, let's see. Wait, wait, let me take a swig of water, we'll get my reading voice on. Ah. I'm finally back from town. It's the longest I've been away since... Uh, I'm just gonna say Margaret, I don't even know how the fuck... Margary? I'm saying Margaret. Since Margaret's illness began. The artifact from the perimeter of the ruins is finally on its way to Northwell as I write this. I hope Lord Branstone will be satisfied with the find. At least enough to comply my request for more workers. Even if they are criminals from Northwell's dungeons. Pretorius was so disappointed that I didn't let him study the artifact. Upset, even. But I brought him here to find a cure for my beloved... Marguerite. Everything else is out of the question. At least until she's well again. Sixth of Rain's Hand. Marguerite's condition worsened while I was away. She's not responding to Pretorius' treatment anymore. I shouldn't have left her. Now Alice is looking pale, too. Pretorius told me that the illness wasn't contagious. Gods, why is this happening to us? First my wife, now my daughter. Marcella was furious. She stormed into the room to try to convince... <clears throat> to try to convince me again to let her take Marguerite and Alice back to Northwell with her. Along with the little... Along with little Varin. She doesn't... Damn. They didn't let him put the apostrophe there. It broke. She doesn't trust Pretorius and his treatments. Never has. We tried everything back in the, con the continent to make her sister well again. But nothing worked. Our last hope lies within the island within the ancient trees. I'm afraid that the illness might be contagious after all. I can't allow anyone to leave the island, not until a cure is found. 
tenth of Rain's hand. Pretorius keeps saying that Marguerite's body is just reacting to the new concoction's properties. He promises that she and Alice will get well soon, and I want to believe him. Gods, give me strength. I don't want to lose my faith. Please, I beg of you. Marguerite passed away four days ago. My little Alice. She's all I have now. Why have the gods forsaken me? Um, I'm terrified that uh, his like his daughter isn't dead and she's gonna be like a zombie baby and then we're just gonna have to fight a zombie baby and that's gonna like fuck me up psychologically. Medieval ad name. I okay, it was like it was Margaret or like Marguerite. Like I'm not gonna say Marguerite, really, I don't know. Oh, oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. That is a little doll. That is a little girl doll, little girl doll. Little girl dollhouse. Oh yeah, that is that oh yeah, it's pretty sad. Here's the thing, it's sad and I feel bad for the, you know, the the, the guy that I just murdered basically. Um uh, Holy fuck that sent chills down my spine. Die you fucking creepy ass ghost bitch. Oh. Oh. Can't have shit in Tamriel on God. Cannot have shit in Tamriel, bro. Oh my f let me read this fucking I hate ghosts. I hate ghosts. Dude, I couldn't even I couldn't even react because it, it actually like froze me. I felt like a chill. You're gonna make fun of me? I, I am a pussy. I admit this, okay? I am a coward. Anytime if it could be the littlest jump scare, it'll fuck me up. That shit scared the fuck out of me. I can't even lie. Okay. I knew when I saw the skeletons, I was like, fuck. Something, something's gonna happen. I know that no one will come find us. Even if they did, it would be too late. If someone finds this diary, get off this godforsaken island as soon as possible. They were fools to think they could cure her. I should have taken you and Alice back to Northwell, but your fool of a husband wouldn't let me do it. I am now concerned that it's only a matter of time before this curse decides to finish me off, but I will not let it, just as I didn't let it take my dear Var Varin. I can't, I can only hope for a quick death. I'm so sorry, my dear sister. Uh, that's a, is that a kid skeleton? I don't know. You cut yourself? Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, fuck. 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 And now I know that the mod author isn't above jump scares, so I'm even more scared than I was before. Oh, I hate that. I hope that was the only one. <laughs> Christ. I want to be off this island. Oh. Okay, we fought like four of them. We'll be fine. Who's shooting me? I'm, I'm in the middle of something. Yeah, where did you come from? Okay, uh, this isn't working. God, it was this Kamehameha? What the fuck? Oh, really? Yeah, okay. And it incinerated him. He didn't even have anything on him, bro. I'm just like killing all these people. They're giving me dirt. Oh, fuck. Okay, so... There's a sickness that's plaguing the island. Uh, that was kind of what I what I initially thought. I'm just confused if it's a sickness or a curse. I think it might be a curse because I don't think sicknesses like make people skeletons, but. Uh, I mean, I think it's. Don't put me in a dark room. Don't put me in a dark room. Don't do that to me. Whatever, bro. If they if they do the jump scare again, I'm, I'm quitting. <laughs> Calling it for tonight. Swyhander? Yo, I might have to. I, this isn't even a two-handed character. Fuck. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Yeah, I don't know. That's crazy. Ain't gonna lie, you kind of look like- You kind of look 30? No way. No way. All right. Honestly, dude, like- Honestly, dude, you've, you've ruined, like, my night and the next couple nights of my life. <laughs> I'm kidding, but, like, god damn. That, that is, like, that is unironically. I'm not even blaming you because, like, you're just being honest. That is, that is the worst, that is the worst thing I've ever heard. I look, one sec, I gotta look at myself on the webcam. Do I look 30 or have you just never seen a 19 year old before? No way, no way, no way. <laughs> this is the, that is actually the worst thing that's ever been said to me in my entire life. No, I respect you for being honest. I just, I'm, uh, this is one of those moments where I wish you weren't. <laughs> this is crazy. Like the more, the more I like, just the more deeper I go into this mod, the more I'm just like impressed by everything I'm seeing. Like, this is so cool. 
It's a little vacant in some places, but that's kind of okay because I just want to soak in the atmosphere sometimes. Okay. And also, like, I'm just glad we're not in an interior with a jump scare. That's pretty nice. Oh, uh, they didn't put a loading screen. Oh, I can just open that shit. Oh, there's a dragon. Okay, that's a dragon up there. This is gonna be nutty. Okay, ancient guardian dragon. Okay, a dual. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Whatever. Come on. Nice miss, idiot. Die. Oh, fuck you. Oh, he just fell to his death. Oh, dumbass. Unlucky, 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 unlucky. Oh, get fucked, get fucked, get fucked, get fucked, get fucked. Nice hit, idiot. Okay. Dragon. Oh, he's just fighting a chicken or something. This is actually pretty vanilla dragon behavior, so it might not actually be anything. Well, that was kind of underwhelming. I hope he doesn't have any loot on him, because I really don't want to go down there. Oh, maybe I was supposed- oh, I was supposed to go down- oh, I'm supposed to go down there. I mean, I, I didn't mean to, like- oh, now you're gonna fly up, asshole? Whatever. You missed. And you're bleeding to death. Kind of badass, I'm not gonna lie. How's it going? Oh! Okay, stop. Stop. You happy? You think I wanted to do that? Okay, so here's the thing, right? L let me give you an example of something that TikTok does, right? Let's say you're a very liberal, like, you know, user of TikTok, right? Um, you know, you're very left-leaning, you have liberal views, so you watch a lot of- you watch and, like, you like and, like, comment on a lot of videos that have, um, you know, like, liberal- have, like, the same- That motherfucker just fell to his death. Sick as fuck, you got COVID? Because I had- I had fucking COVID. Uh, I know, in 20, in 2022, can you believe it? I was waiting, dog. Yeah, no, I'm sorry, bro. Okay, finals. They fu let me let me tell you, right? Because let me tell you about like when I did have COVID. Because this, I had a motherfucking professor who literally like I had COVID, right? So in accordance to my college's policy, we're not allowed to like we're literally not allowed to go to school, right? And in college, you'll find that there are two types of professors. There are some professors that really just don't give a fuck, and then there are professors that like give too much of a fuck, right? I had a pretty good mix of both. I had like one professor who gave too much of a fuck, right? So what would happen is that like, you know, he, he would grade our attendance. Even if we didn't participate, he would just like give us like a grade based on our attendance, right? So if you missed a day of class, I don't know, like your grade would go from an 100 to like a 97 or whatever, right? So I got COVID and I told this motherfucker like, hey, like, you know, I have COVID. I can literally cannot come to like class. And what he did was he read the email, marked me absent for both the classes, and then responded to the email by saying like sorry to hear that get better soon and i'm like you slimy old fucking fart of a man like and the word like and i mean this i mean this in like the, the 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 nicest most sincere way possible is that he's he he was an old ass guy if i went to class with covid and he got it he'd be dead and, it, and like, you know, you could say it's my fault, but it's his fault for holding my grade hostage like that. I mean, I did, and I just ate the, you know, I just ate the attendance grade, and I still passed the class to suck my dick. But, you know, you want to you wanna play that game. Probably one at a test. No, there was, no, 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 because um the way, it was a half sem course, right? So it wasn't even, like, that big. Probably one at a test. Oh, COVID test? No, I, I sent, I sent him the COVID test in the email. I, t I told you, he read the email back, and then he just, like, said, like, get fucked, lol. He literally marked me absent before even responding to the email. That's how I knew. No, I sent I sent him two different tests, too. Oh, yeah, no, he's tripping. And, like, here's the thing. Dude, like, after I got that, and then, like, you know, maybe I shouldn't be saying this on stream. But, like, after, after I got, like, after I got marked out for the attendance, there was a part of me that was, like, I should just go to class anyway and, like get his ass sick and then like you know mark his ass absent when he's like on his deathbed for the last couple weeks whatever that's fucked up <laughs> you get what i'm saying though i was like i wouldn't i wouldn't actually go through it but through with it but there was a point where i was like maybe you know maybe i get this motherfucker sick and you know 
bio weapon. That's that's what I'm talking about, bro. Actual bio weapon. Because I thought about it. I do. I'm not gonna lie. Like I, I'm not, like I, don't, I I know it's embarrassing. Like COVID fucked me up so bad I couldn't even drive to like class if I wanted to. But I was like, dude, maybe I should just risk getting into a car crash just to fuck this guy up. Not even physically. I don't have to lay a finger on him. I just give him. I just give him the Rona. You know. Played Skyrim in years. Yeah, it's a it's a quest. I mean, I have a shit ton of mods and stuff, but like I'm I'm mostly playing the quest mod. It's called Darken. No. I was literally talking to Sally Bugs earlier. Like that's the reason why like I can't even pl like. There was a period of, of li um, uh, like in my life where like I was playing. I wasn't even playing Skyrim. I was fixing Skyrim. You know what I mean? What by the time I got it fixed so I could actually play it, I was just so sick of it. I just like I was so sick of like play like just fucking fixing it that I just didn't touch it. So, I I was in that boat, but no, you yeah, you need a fucking PhD just to know how to like navigate the mods folder. It's crazy, but my 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 personal recommendation is use Mo2, yeah, use Mod Organizer 2, um, watch Gamer Poets, and if you have a problem with anything else, just search up your problem and then put Reddit at the end of it, and nine times out of ten you'll be fine. Will will it still take eighteen years to like? install big titty goth gf mod number 33 yes but you know if you're not willing to fight for something then what are you what are you living for this is gonna be a rough uh set of events that we go through tonight please stop stop with the water stop with the water stop with the water okay i can take you all on but i'm only gonna take you on one by one just so we're clear you know, I kind of miss, I kind of miss the, the jump scares. I feel like those were nicer than what we're going through right now. What's the, what, what did Starscream say in the famous hit movie Transformers? Not calling you a coward master, but sometimes cowards do survive. Amen to that. He was so real. He was so real for that. The entire fucking. Okay. No, if I, if I conjure something, there's, there's literally a 30% chance I'm going to crash the game. What are you doing, bro? This ain't even about you. Nice miss, idiot. Okay, he did he, he did good. Well, I do good. I don't know why he just waited. Like, he just kind of took that to show me that he could. That's kind of fire, I can't even say. You fucking nerd. I finished the book. You can't even, like... I just realized I, I didn't buff myself. I'm gonna die. Hi, right, buddy. Oh my god, the fucking bitch slap. Please! No! Okay, stop, stop doing that, sir. I need that shield. It's the- it's literally my only form of protection. Thank you. Please stop. Oh my god, I took a fucking- I did the fucking- he did the fucking spin around, man. I can't- Because I think the fact that he put- If he put two sentries in this room, that would have been fine. The man put four. That is- that is, that is actually, like, fucking torture. Okay, you know what, if he just backs up, keeps his distance? No, of course not, why would he? Sir. Sir, we could, we can work together here. You wanna, you wanna stay in here, I wanna leave. We both want to, we both want me out of this room. Okay. I'm kind of finessing right now, though. I'm kind of finessing. I'm kind of finessing. I'm not finessing, I've... Okay. <laughs> We're cheating. Yeah. Okay, so I induced my heart attack, I stole his key, and we're leaving. If that was a one-on-one, -on -one, I would have kicked his ass. I just want that to be known. What the fuck was all that? I saw like 16, I saw like six boss bars. Oh, what the fuck? Am I in hell? Oh my god. This is so pretty though, in a weird way. Oh my god, you f I'm trying to admire the fucking scenery, asshole. Oh my god, I hate- Oh, you fucking Christ! What, dude? I'm like, I'm having a- I'm like, trying to fucking- Oh my god, you're such a prick! You're such a prick! I was in the middle of something! Dude, you're nothing, bro. You're dirt. You're doggy doo-doo. Alright, get the fuck- Give me your- Give me your ass. I gotta- I, I gotta find new words. I keep saying ass, I'm sorry. I can do better. I just need time. I haven't streamed in like a month. Two months. And- and this this mod i'm at my wits end okay after that room with like the the one guy and the the, the four other guys five guys burgers and fries that's that they literally i fought the five guys and i killed one of them and took his key so i don't know 
This is so cool though, holy shit. I mean, I can't see anything, but this is so cool. Oh! Oh, he fancy. Come on. No, oh, I hit him so hard he teleported to the left. Ebony Guardian Archer? Uh, Ebony Guardian dead. Are they fighting each other? Oh, they're fighting him. Never mind. The hell is that thing? Okay, whatever, I'll fight it. I mean, after Stone Golem, okay. After what I just went through, there's like, there's nothing you could show me. Yeah, look at that. Oh my god, that health. I don't even have to heal anymore if I just hit him once. Okay, I, I gotta stop being so cocky. Wait, I wanna see how much this health the drain is. Stop fucking doing that, asshole! He's humbling me, I respect that in a way, but... Door? Catacombs. This is gonna- I'm gonna get jump scared again. I can't wait. <sighs> Skeleton priest keeper. Okay, I understand. I'm, I'm, you know. Oh my god, are you sitting crisscross applesauce? That's so cool. Please don't hurt me. Just like get fucking shenanigan, bro. I don't even know what you want me to do. If I get jump scared, I'm uninstalling the mod and giving it a zero. Yeah, I'm gonna get jumped. I was fine with it, like, you know, the first time. Okay, well, that's. Oh, that's kind of cool. This is not good. <laughs> so yeah, the one thing I'm noticing is that like, so far one of my biggest problems with this mod is that enemies have damaging auras, which makes it very hard. Also, for some reason this guy has no sound effects when I hit him, but that's okay. Okay, that's fine. I'll take the Ancient Blessing too. May okay, I guess maybe he wasn't the boss fight. Or is this doing like the the Dark Souls and thing where not all fog gates are boss fights? Nope, this is a boss fight. <laughs> okay, I thought the game just crashed. Okay, well, I'm gonna bring a friend with me too. You know what? Uh, get his ass. Oh, cool. Now, oh my God, eight damage. Okay, that's- that bodes well. I think that's the spell the, uh... Okay. Okay, so he's not that bad. My Daedroth just sucks ass. For- for George, I know he was getting obliterated. And I wasn't, I wasn't even he was getting obliterated. This guy just had so much fucking health, it was kind of crazy. But luckily, I, like I said, I do have, you know, a mod that makes me do more damage. So... There we go. And I think this was the very first gate we came across. Yes, it was. Well, everyone, we've done it. We've reached the end of Darkened, or I guess I shouldn't say the end, but I guess we've reached the end. There's still definitely some stuff we missed out on. Um, I'm not going to go back through it just because, um, quite frankly, I don't want to. <laughs> I think I'll, um, I don't think we missed anything big. I don't think we missed, like, a boss fight or anything. As far as I'm concerned, I think we progressed, quote-unquote, the right way. So, I'm satisfied with that. But, thank you all for your, uh, time. I had a really good time. I had a really great time with this mod. I think, I think there were just two boss fights that just kind of made me, kind of soured it for me. That last guy, that last guy, I, I think if we were playing vanilla... That, that last, or we weren't using the rebalance mod, then he would have been so much worse. But I want, I want to keep, I want, I want everyone to keep the two things in mind, right? The, um, the one tall white guy in the room surrounded by like a bunch of sentries or whatever, that guy was, was fine. It's the fact that he was surrounded by like four, four sentries. That is like crazy, right? Four sentries, like if it was honestly like, if it was one sentry, it would have been fine. Two is pushing it. At least for me, sentries were some of like the hardest hitters in this mod. So I I don't know. Maybe 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 like I said, like on a vanilla, on a vanilla game or you know whatever, they would be easier. But I want everyone to keep in mind that I have a rebalance specifically for this mod, and I I've modded my damage for both me and general enemies to be way higher. 
So that way when we hit each other, you know, the fights don't go on forever, basically. I was hitting them. They were hitting me pretty hard. I was hitting them, you know, decently hard. They were hitting harder. But sentries were crazy strong. I know, this, ar this, this armor isn't, like, enchanted or anything. You know, in a lot of ways, that's kind of my own fault, but it's whatever. Um, but yeah. So I think literally just the, like, the second, like, the third to last and second to last boss fight, in order of how I completed the boss fights, were kind of just the ones that, like, made me be like, okay, I'm not doing this, right? Like, I just don't, I'm not gonna sit here for three hours and, like, put up with that. Um, yeah, and then, and then putting two of those, like, big, tall white guys with the, like, two vampire dudes with, the, like, the life drain aura, that was crazy. I think, I think that whole thing would have been a lot better, um, if it was just the two vampire dudes. I, I, there's a lot of things you could have removed from that fight that could have made it, like, hard as fuck, but, like, decent, like, bearable, you know what I mean? Like, one, make one of them not have a bow, because fuck, like, god, that's so annoying when you're, like, fighting three enemies at once and one asshole just nips you with a bow. Um... Or just get rid of that health drain effect. I think if even if the health drain effect got removed, it still would have been bullshit because it's like four super powerful tanky enemies in one area that with like no cover. That's another thing too. I think I think if the if that one like you know the, the with the big white guy, if that fight had more cover in a bigger arena, I don't think I would have been as mad, or I would I wouldn't have been as bullshit. You know, because I think there were times where like I was I I killed one, I was hiding behind cover and like I was generally safe, but. You know, they pulled something out of their ass. Um, but yeah, that's um, that's my two cents. I think overall, like, the mod is way better than it is bad. I just think, like, for those last, like, that last little slug of it, there's some ass, there's some bullshit. There could be bullshit in some of the other areas, the beginning areas, I don't know. Didn't see any. It didn't feel bullshit to me, at least. But overall, it, it was a really great mod. I, I really, I really see why it has the reputation it does. Um, I, I, I do think that it, it definitely needed like some difficulty adjustments, but yeah, really, really great mod. Um, yeah, it's crazy to me that, like, like the setting, the scenery, all that stuff. Like that was, that was some of the best use I've ever seen of like Skyrim assets. And I think this was like pre, oh, it couldn't have been pre Dawn Guard. Never mind. Yeah, that was crazy. I've never, I've like, uh, granted, I haven't played quest mods in a while, but like, I don't think I've ever seen like a post-apocalyptic skyrim area done as well as that almost i still also this is my own fault because i think if i did more exploring i would have figured it out but um the story what of what happened my only thing i could figure out was that there was just like some either some plague or some curse i think it was a curse anyway uh bit of a shorter stream i'm gonna wrap it up but yeah that was fantastic like i said great mod nothing but praise you should really try it out yeah you should really try it out it's really cool Anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you had a good night. Hope you had a good time. I know I did, and I will see you all in the future.